Anchoring was a bit of a rusty manoeuvre. <laughs> oh, we got there. <laughs> I can do it, I can do it. You can do it, you can do it. Well, in an attempt to get our sailing mojo back, we're learning just how much of it we've lost. <laughs> So why have we got the horse blanket, Bev? Oh, I know we're not going far and I know it's... We're probably not going to raise the sail and we're going to have to motor there. We're only going to not go a mile, for God's sake. We're just desperate to get out, but... It's not in me. <laughs> I can't go sailing without the bag unzipped and the horse blanket off. It's got to be done. It's how you do it. You don't go out without it. So, or, rather, you do go out without it. You don't go out with it still stuck in the thing. There are some things you just got to do. Oh, golly. Well, I'm an incredibly nervous bunny. I think uh, it's mainly because we haven't been out for so long. <laughs> that's, but, a, that's, um, a, that's an understatement. Yeah, it was so bad we've actually had grass growing out of the traps. So. Yeah, we actually had grass growing aboard, that's how long it's been. Probably. Yeah. But, uh, Beverly, apparently, I, I filmed one, but Beverly had uh, I, I, already <laughs> turfed out half a dozen ready shoots already. I had a lawn starting back there. <laughs> <coughs> so yeah. we're recovering from our colds, as you can hear. Um, yeah. In other news, thank God for the checklist. Oh, I had to go through it loads of times. It's like... Yeah. Oh, days. I've forgotten this, I've forgotten, forgotten that. that. Forgotten the other. Uh, I'd even forgot what switches did what. <laughs> it's like, duh. Right, back to days. Back to no comp crew. <laughs> <laughs> um, I can put Annie on now. Yay! Oh, is she not on? I could do it. No, that's our autopilot. The, um, yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Annie is now on. Right, okay, so. All of the switches are off. Excellent news. Right, you go forward and I'll come aft. Well, we'd best do something with these lines. Yeah. That's fine. I'll just stick it here. Let's just go before we change the <laughs> Right, I'm going to slip off first because our direction would be good. You know, for reversing out. Yeah. Oh, hang on a second before we go anywhere. Propeller test. Props turning. It's not filed. Okay, hold your line. Okay, give me a few seconds. All right, slip off. Ready, slip forward. Reversing. Actually, remember to face the right way. Whoa! Oh, no. <coughs> okay. Okay, last part of take control. newbie sailors again. <laughs> oh. but, uh, We're just trying to remember which end faces forward. It's been a while. <laughs> huh? Forward. Bally home for the night. Oh, Exciting, isn't it? Yeah. Exciting oh, well. times oh, ahead. Like sail much. Well, we're prepped just in case. It's okay, go. Stop, 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 Lord. Drop it, drop it, drop it. There's a 
touch. That's enough. Up you go. Oh. Backwards, out of practice. <laughs> Badly out of practice. <laughs> so you have to be putting it on the wind. Okay, the there we go. Got more momentum. Sorry, my fault. Okay, it's no problem. Hold yet, so you don't have to worry just yet. There you go, that'll do. Let's see what that does. Let's give her a little bit of tick over. You can ease the top and lift anytime you want. Oh, ease the top and lift. Because it's well up. That's eased. Really? Well, it probably moved quite a bit, I would expect. It really looks like the boom's very high. Well, the ropes are suck as buggery. Okay, well, fair days. I haven't winched it down with the kicker I mean, though. I mean, you look at you look at how high the boom is. Hang on, just give me a second. I guess it is what it is. I haven't pulled it down with a ticker. Let's give it a wee yank on that. Okay, we'll just let, we'll, just, we'll just go with it. What do you think? Let's just go with the flow, yeah? Let's go with the flow. No, it, it left. <laughs> there was a boat called Florence. And it's definitely gone. <laughs> it's gone. Oh, maybe that knock we heard this morning was her. It could well have been. Joe, I thought it was you and Flo. Sorry we missed you. We just didn't get up quick enough when we heard the knock. <sighs> right, so if you release that jenny sheet off the winch, we can work with this one here and put a bit of jenny out. Okay, well that's released. If the loads being this light, I'm going to keep, I'm going to keep it near a, a couple of reefs in jenny, you know, so it doesn't have to hold the weight of the family. Yes, of course. In an attempt to get our sailing mojo back, we're learning just how much of it we've lost. <laughs> yeah, like um... like putting the autopilot on and not actually pressing auto. <laughs> <laughs> That's when we discovered the boat tacks itself. Sometimes <laughs> you leave it alone. I was like, I think we're tacking. I was like, oh yeah. It was more like being heave two, wasn't it? It was. It was a very nice heave two. <laughs> boat heave two, all by itself. Lovely thing. <laughs> We've got a fishing boat coming in, not worried about him. Uh, what's that? There's that a patch of weed. Don't know, it might have been a seal or something in the water, but it's not there now, whatever it is. Mm. We've got a racing mark about a good fraction of a mile ahead. We've got another racing mark inboard of us, but I'm not worried about either. But uh, Oh, I just like the fact that it is just out. We just it was very difficult to get out today, wasn't it, Ben? It was very difficult to motor see it ourselves, wasn't it? Because it just seemed to be everything just taking so long because the boat hasn't moved in months. It really hasn't. It was ages take getting a clean. And then when I had actually got a clean, 
I just realised I'd run out of pet. So I had to go to sleep. So you should have quick snooze, and about the time she came out of the snooze, all the wind had got and we thought, oh, it's not worth it. But we've decided to anchor in Bally Home Bay for the night, and hopefully that'll make it worth it, won't it? Oh, Dinner's just, in Mr. D already. Yeah, just get out of the marina. Sometimes you just got to shake things up a bit because... They say with procrastination, the secret to breaking it is just to get started. Well, we've been procrastinating for so long, it's ridiculous. <laughs> so, out here, our laptops will gobble up whatever powers in their battery in next to no time because the batteries in them are absolutely knackered. Again? Again. Well, it's been a couple of years ago now. I suppose it has. But it was yeah. the previous trip down, not last year's trip, but the year yeah, before, or maybe okay. even the year before that. Yeah. Yeah. That we replaced them in Dunleary. We did. So anyway, we're just tootling along. It'll do us absolutely no harm to be off the off the nip, off the teat of the marina, off, <laughs> off the feeding nipple, which is land. <laughs> yeah, and break out into the big bad sea. Which isn't very bad tonight, thankfully. It's still, it as big, is, still as big as it ever was, but it's not too bad. Trust me on this. It is so flat. I mean, so it's not jelly-like. No, it's not. But it's pretty for calm. But let's put it like this. If you're going to get your mojo back, this is a good night to do it. The only thing that gives me concern is I think we've turned up on Catch Saturday. Oh, well, there's a sailing catch over there, there's a catch at anchor over there, there's a catch at anchor over there, we passed a catch coming out. Maybe they're having a um, catch regatta. Maybe they're just having a catch up. Bevy and I are just having fun sailing, but we were, a few seconds ago, over five degrees! <laughs> or heel, yeah. Heel. But I think um, if you do want to get your mojo back, remembering to have fun! Isn't it Bev? Yes, I'm going out on a very mild day like this where there's just about enough wind to sail so anything you get wrong is not really a disaster. If you went out here in like 4-6, you'd know all about it. I mean, you really would know all about it. Any mistake you make would probably cost something, but on a day like this? Yeah, but it's just it's much more fun. It's much more fun. Yeah, and that's what I think Bevy and I need Excuse at the moment. I cough my guts up with the remainder of my coat. Oh, <laughs> God. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, did you start as well? Yeah. Oh. 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 Get fun back into sailing. <laughs> <laughs> Well, <laughs> anchoring was a bit of a rusty manoeuvre. <laughs> well, we got there. The wind, uh, the wind actually gusted and uh, didn't really help matters, did it? No, um, it's certainly a lot stronger than we were predicted. But we sailed. We did, and we're in. Woohoo! <laughs> so we're at anchor, and we're going to have dinner at anchor. <laughs> the anchor ball is up. <sighs> you can tell Bevy's happy. Oh yeah. Right, I'll get the horse blanket on and I'll do the uh, spinnaker lines and things like that. Now, 
The reason it's starting to fail is the voltage from the batteries has to be quite high uh, because we've decided that we're going to pull the anchor and go in.